In this video, we are going to learn, how to use local storage in Adobe Captivate. Web storage objects, local storage allow to save key and value pairs in the browser. The local storage object stores data with no expiration date. The data will not be deleted when the browser is closed, and will be available the next day, week, or year. The local storage property is read-only. Unlike cookies, web storage objects are not sent to server with each request. Because of that, we can store much more. Most browsers allow at least 2 megabytes of data. And have settings to configure that. Also unlike cookies, the server can't manipulate storage objects, via HTTP headers. Everything's done in JavaScript. Here, we have two template namely course 1 and course 2. The set item method allows us to store values in the local storage object. Here, we are going to assign variable learner name to get value from user and store it with set item method in local storage. In course 1, we are going to get the user name and assign this text box with the variable learner name. Select submit button. Enter our script in JavaScript window. Let we move to our course 2 module. The first slide will be same as in course 1. This slide will not appear for already existing learner, and will appear only for the new learner. We have to get the learner name, from local storage. And, store the value in variable, username. If username is available, then the slide number 2 have to play. Its index value is 1. Else, the slide number 1 have to play. Its index value is 0. Paste the JavaScript on the slide entry of course 2. We set variable, username in next 3 slide, to display the learner name from local storage. We will check local storage in the application tab with the help of web developer tool. Entering the learner name and click on the submit button in course 1. Immediately we can notice the key value as learner name and value as RIA in local storage. Let we refresh the course too. The local storage already had a learner name so it should start from the second slide. Now we can see our entered learner name in the text caption in each slide. Local storage, is a simple way to save, and retrieve user data in Adobe Captivate, and make courses more dynamic.